National Capital is to issue stock. But how does stock make its way from the issuing company to investors? A company first makes its stock available for public purchase through an initial public offering, or IPO. For most companies, the first step in this process is to employ the assistance of an investment bank. Acting as an underwriter, the investment bank helps the company establish various details of the IPO, including how much money it hopes to raise, the types of securities that will be offered, and the initial price per share. Once the Securities Exchange Commission reviews the prepared filing for the company's IPO, the investment bank plays a role in selling the shares that will eventually make their way to the public at large. It essentially serves as a facilitator, often employing the assistance of a selling group to market the issuing company's offering to potential investors. So who can purchase these initial stocks? Since underwriters want to ensure that the entire offering can be sold, they typically set their sights on larger institutional investors for these primary issues rather than individuals. Individual investors generally must wait to purchase these shares.